The use of drones in police operations. Technology is advancing daily, and it is being used almost everywhere, from our private life to our society, for various reasons. Police are nowadays using drones to fight against crime in a faster way. Currently, there are about 18,000 police departments around the United States, of which only about a thousand are using drones. It is expected to increase the use of drones by a drastic number within the upcoming two or three years by the U.S. police departments. So, there are several uses for those drones when talking about police departments. Starting with number one, drones are used for search and rescue. These have completely changed the face of search and rescue. In the past, which work would have taken hours and hours to complete now takes only 10 to 20 minutes, the police department uses a drone to save a life, whether somebody wandered away or there could be a lost child etc. There are some advanced drones, such as the DJI Mavic 2, where you can relay a message to the victim via a speaker attached to the top of the drone. Number 2 is Accident Reconstruction. Now one can use all sorts of drones for accident reconstruction. There is a drone named DJI Phantom 4 RTK which will give you precision level accuracy down to the centimeter, and you can take reliable measurements from your map after you've shot all of your pictures. For accident reconstruction, when you're going to court, you can pop a drone up, take several pictures of the area, go back, and reconstruct that map. Instead of taking pictures from around the crime scene, you're popping one drone up, which will give you a reliable map. Next is support for local fire. Police departments use Mavic 2 Enterprise Advance and assist with the fire department when needed. If a house catches fire and police can pop a thermal drone up in the air, it sees heat signatures, and it can tell through the roof exactly where the source of that fire was, so drones could be a big deal in the fire departments as well. Next up is event management. Now think of something like any four-day music festival. Thousands of people are showing up to see their favorite celebs but it can get a little overwhelming for a police department to keep track of them. That is where drones come into the picture. A drone named Matrice 300 RTK is going to have about a 40-minute flight time, and one can always bring it down and send it right up. Drones can help keep things under control. Next up is interior flying. Now, this might sound a little scary at first. Using the DJI Mini 2, one can crack a window or break glass and send the drone inside the room before they send any of the SWAT team members into the building. So it can save lives by protecting the people who are protecting us. Last but not least is, mapping the city. Think about that being able to use a freshly generated Google map whenever you need one because that is what mapping with the drone does. It will give you an accurate layout of your city by which police departments conveniently get lots of information about the whole city. Through these points, we can conclude that drones are the future of crime fighting. If you liked our video, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to get great content regularly.